everybody. This is your girl, Lucinda Speaks, coming to you once more and again with another video. Girl, get your popcorn. Mm-hmm. Ooh, it's all good. Mm, mm, mm. Did y'all get y'all popcorn yesterday? Because, girl, it went down. Mm-hmm. It went down. Want to talk about it? Here you go. Woo, girl. So anyway, listen, I saw everything just like you guys saw everything. And I, you know, please, if, if you can, try to show a uh, first lady uh, as much decorum and compassion as you can. Because she was hurt yesterday. She was really hurt yesterday. That was that part was not a skit. That part was not a skit. Um, and I see Reverend Ike has taken a different turn this morning. Um, you know, he he realizes that that they are a good pair, you know. Um, can they work it out? Uh I don't know because like I said before, I just don't think that Reverend Ike is in a position where he is a uh, relationship or husband material, if that is First Lady's goal. And if we go back to that vision board, that's First Lady's goal. She's dating with a purpose, and I don't think Reverend Ike is quite seeing that same purpose. That's a red flag, in my opinion. So, when I did my videos, it was to inform ladies of how we manipulate situations. We want control. We always want to see what's going on, be a part of this, be recognized as this woman, and all that kind of stuff because we want to win the prize. We see the man as the prize. We want to, you know, win. We want to let the other women know, yeah, I got them, yeah, I got them. But ladies, we are not each other's enemies. And we have got to stop that foolery. Okay? We are the prize. And it's okay with being friends with other women. When you walk in the room, let your radiance show. See, it's not about the body. Let me tell you something. I grew up in a day where there was natural bodies. And I definitely had a very nice figure. I've been blessed. Very, very blessed. And I thank God for that. But that takes work. It takes maintenance right expensive maintenance and so with that being said ladies i don't have time we don't have time to fight each other there's enough men to go around that if we date somebody that comes out of prison uh maybe we we may get lucky i don't know because i haven't had that experience but um you want to be the best you can be now, my word of advice in this situation to you, first lady, is to build and to stand and to work and to grind on your own platform since you have it. Now, you said that you make six figures and six figures, uh, those, are, those are a lot. Those are a lot of figures. Six is more than one. So, if you make one figure, six figures is more than one figure. So, yeah, that's a lot of figures. And that, yeah, it is a lot of figures. So now, if you if if, if, if that's the case, then you have a uh, you have a platform right there. There's so many people who are aspiring to be in that field. That's a platform right there. Uh, you said that you apply pressure. You said you apply pressure, the pressure, the pressure. Now, I assume you mean with your style and grace, allow me to uh, you know. These dishes are lyrical, you know. I know I'm saying it wrong, but anyway, since you have the pressure, that's that, hey, work on it, do some videos about how to apply pressure. You applying it, do some videos on it. All right, you see what I'm saying? Stay out the man business for one thing because he don't need you running it, he don't like it. He's already told you that on many occasions. The man has told you, you got your own channel, your own supporters, do you. And second of all, you didn't have to be up under him 24-7. Every time you get out of work, said you're going to get in the real bed, getting you some real doggone sleep. You you laid up uh, over there in the doggone uh, broom closet. Yes, the broom closet. 
stuff piled up here, stuff piled up there. You can't live like that. And then the man did a video about the wig on the floor and all of that. Now, I'm sure it wasn't meant to be a joke, but he was really saying he wants space. Okay? He's been in a cell. He's been in a cell. Uh, I don't know how big the cell is, but I've heard it's small. Give the man some space. You ain't got to be up on them all the time. Now, come on now. And then you want to talk about you fighting uh, the reaction channels and you fighting the go. Baby, baby, baby. You fighting yourself. Go to your house. Live your life. Date. Date. Just because you've been with somebody three months does not mean you have to move in. Y'all stop this foolishness. Stop moving in with everybody you meet and that you have a conversation with more than two or three days. Stop moving in with everybody. Live on your own. Travel on your own. Do your own thing. Do your own career. Quit trying to live with everybody you meet. I'm sick of it. I'm sick of it. Stop moving in with every man that smiles your way. It's crazy. Credit messed up. Economy messed up. And you jokers leaving apartments. Then you breaking leases. And then you're moving in with this one. Stop all that foolery. Now, I know you didn't technically move in, but if you were living somewhere else, look like you live in an apartment, you're paying rent over there, stay at your own place. Then you want to talk about you fighting the reaction channels. Girl, you're not fighting the reaction channels. You're fighting yourself. Now, I know he done, you know, done some things that blew your mind. Honey, I understand. I definitely... ba da ba 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 I know he did some things that blew your mind, but it didn't mean be a fun man 24-7. Now, River Knight on, on social media talking about uh, social media uh, 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 took uh, First Lady. No, it didn't. Y'all took, y'all created this mess. And Rev, while we're on the subject, looking at how you are and your pattern, people, you know, the congregation... Well, some parts of the congregation, because I ain't part of that congregation, but some parts of the congregation have, I've seen in the comments, they've tried to drop us some little hints and stuff like that. But, you know, it is what it is. I guess she didn't want to listen, you know, whatever the case may be. But first lady, the purpose of this video is to let you know the reaction channels are not your enemy. Yes, we report on things that we see from our perspective. And from our perspective, everything you do is not okay. Whether or not you believe it or not. And I know y'all sick of uh, baby girl barking throughout this video. But I'm going to have to upload it anyway because it's real life. And when you have a pet, sometimes they do have tantrums and they want your attention. So that's just the way it is. But anyway... I'm going to get on off of here and uh, get her straight, give her a treat, because that's really what this whole uh, tantrum is about. It's really over a treat that I did not give her earlier, and I turned around and didn't give her any of this popcorn, so she is very upset with me. Mm-hmm. Yep. But anyway, girl, uh, I shared in, the, and I'm gonna share. Listen, I love a lot of the vloggers out here, especially the, you know, black, the black vloggers. And one of my favorite ones is Platinum D, girl. Platinum D, girl, I love you. And um, first lady, you uh, you know, you say you apply pressure and all this. Do some stuff like what Platinum D. She always bringing us the deals, the steals, darling. She always bringing us nice places to eat. She always showing us how to finesse, finagle, how to bring the pressure. Okay? Do like her. Show, show us. Show us, girl. Show us. We want to see, first lady. Okay? All right. Now, y'all be easy on first lady. Now, she going through some things. Y'all be easy on them. But, first lady, if they do bring you some pressure, just remember, you asked for it. 
And now you're going to get it. But now I'm sure, and I am being encouraging, I'm very sure that you're going to take this as an opportunity to build your brand. You're going to, you know, you're going to get out there and, you know, get the gym and you're going to get that little revenge going on, baby. And we're going to see you out there. If you choose not to go back to Reverend, I'm sure you're going to get another deacon or trustee or maybe another pastor. And you're going to come show us, you know, some things and that and that and that. Or, like you've done before, the video will pop up, the rev, and you'll be in the background. Like y'all always do. Now I'm kind of I'm, I'm I I don't know I just and maybe I should do a poll. Is she gonna go back? Or is she gonna do her own thing? Which one? Cause I know you know it's hard to say. Cause you can never go on what social media says. But I'll be here. I will be here watching. I'll be here looking and peeping and peering. And I'm gonna talk about it. I'm definitely going to be talking about it. So, y'all, make sure when you see me go live or if you see Shonda go live or Ocean or anybody go live, uh, Legends or any, Well, I don't know about Legends. He even talked about stuff like this. But if you see any of the people who I am frequently with go live, nine times out of ten, it's going to be talked about. Because it's a topic. Because we already saw this coming. We already saw this coming. Now, I never thought that that, that she would have fallen out with a, a moderator. I don't know everything that that's about. So, I don't know. Because, you know, I don't really watch it intently like that. But, girl, ooh, that was a lot. Anyway, let me finish watching some of my vlogs. And I got some work to do. And I'm going to get back and go back and see what's going on. Finish up this popcorn. Smart food. If y'all out there, somebody work for smart food. Y'all holler at me because this popcorn is good. Mmm. Mmm-hmm. Anyway, I'll talk to y'all later. Mmm, so good. Mmm, mmm, mmm. Bye.